I seriously just had a 10 out of 10 experience at the DMV in Florida. I'm not even joking. It was amazing. It was so, but I had everything. I took everything in there. Everything. I even took some hair out of the hairbrush for some DNA. But nonetheless, I got my Florida license. I've never done that. I lived in Illinois for a year and I never got Illinois license. That's how you know she real. She ain't coming back. But I miss my family so bad. They're coming this weekend though. They better hurry up That's what they better do. All right, I gotta go. Can you, well, first off, can you believe I went to the DMV looking like this to get my picture made for my driver's license that I'm going to have until 2032? <laughs> One thing is for certain. Appearances has never been my strong point. Okay, anyway. I'm like, that's, that's terrible too, but that's not why we're here. I don't know what world this is, but it's, it's giving. Um, my boobs a huge appearance. This Mustang is saving me money. Money on gas, money on everything. Because I went to the grocery, I peopled, I went to the store, I actually got out of the house. Maverick's with the nanny today. Um, I went to the DMV, you know that already. Went to the post office, the Target, and to the Walmart, and I haven't peopled out for the next three weeks, so I'm going back home. But, when you're in a, when you go grocery shopping and you own a Suburban or a Wagoneer, Sky's the limit. Get anything you want loaded up. And then you wonder when you get to the checkout why you just spent a car payment at the Walmart or the Target. Well, because I had room to pack at home. When you're traveling in a smaller vehicle, you know you don't have that room, so you know you can't get it. I looked at 10 different things, thinking, ooh, I want that, I want that. I ain't got a room for it. Now, before, when I had them big SUVs, see a piece of furniture beside the road, see an antique store, go to Home Goods, wherever, sure. If you want to take five extra people home, I got you. Me and Stella, we ain't got room for nothing and nobody. This baby barely holds a gallon of milk, but I got that trunk. That trunk is screaming for mercy right now. There is a lot. I somehow managed to get two 24 packs of Coca-Cola Classic in that trunk with everything else. All right, let's go home. No, we can't go home, and I'll tell you why. Lady, could you walk faster? I'm in a manual. You're making my feet work too much. Thank you. I gotta get gas. She's sucking the fumes. When I drove her in from West Virginia a month ago or however long I've been here, I don't know, time just is all going together. Um, she was dead on empty when I brought her in. I gotta get gas. I'm back to finish the part that cut off. Maverick's not going to a public school. He's actually gonna be going to a private school for kids like him. And that, don't get emotional. Makes me emotional thinking about it. I'm excited about it. It's a little further from the house than I anticipated, but this is the house that I wanted. This is the house I fell in love with. And I prayed, Lord, if it's meant for me to be in Florida, that house has to work out. It has to fall into my lap. And it did. <laughs> so I know we're in the home that we're supposed to be in and we love it. Uh, just getting him to school is going to be a little bit of a, well, they have a bus, but it's like a 30 minute drive from where we live, but it's okay. It's all going to work out. I'm excited about him going to this school though. I'm excited about being here and everybody's so nice here. And like it was, the DMV was even delightful. I know who can say that, uh, but I'm excited about him starting at this new school. Cause I've been really stressed about it. <laughs>